What's going on guys? It's me again. And figured I'd do an update about a few things um, real quick for some people that were wanting to know some things about this glove. I've had a lot of people that evidently uh, want to see this get finished, which I can understand. I'm pretty excited to see it get finished too. And I've had requests about, you know, blades. When am I going to put blades on? And uh, what what I'm dealing with here, guys, what this is, just so I'm going to make myself clear on this, just in case some, some of you may not have caught on to what I'm doing here, because I know that a lot of the people that are watching are not builders, and so they wouldn't understand some of my lingo. But essentially what I'm doing with this glove, it is a master build glove, or a mother glove, and essentially what it's for is a representation of what I have, at least to the best of my abilities, have done to try to create my own version of a part one glove, and I've put my own bins into it, you know, tried to match them up to screen as close as I could, and I do things my own way somewhat, but for the most part I try to keep it as close to a part one glove as possible without, you know, going too crazy. But I do add my own little touches to it, you know, that makes it look different from anybody else's work. At least I hope to think that my work, you know, stands alone and looks like my work, and that's, that's what I'm out to achieve. So that's what I've got instilled into this piece that I've made here. And it is a master representation of what I'm going to do with all of my other gloves. So it's going to be a piece that will be taken apart and put together and, and disassembled and so forth many, many times in order to get every single glove that I build shaped as close to this one as I can. And since this is not finalized, which it's very, it's coming to finalization, but it's still pre-final as far as this prototype goes. It's a pre-final prototype. It means that it's got most of what it needs in there, but it's still not perfect. It's still missing things that I need to add and I need to work on. So, essentially, that's what this is. And as I build each glove, I'm going to readjust the templates slightly because I can't tell what's going on with my templates until I get them really shaped out good. And these are really close to what I'm looking for, but they still have issues and problem areas that I'm not happy with that need to be adjusted. And there will be small incremental adjustments made to the templates with each glove that I build until I build a finalized piece that I'm pretty much happy with, that I've covered everything that I can see with my eye and then I'll build a, a new build glove, which will be the final build glove. And so this is actually the final prototype, but it's going to go through it's going to go through changes and phases before it becomes the finalized glove, which will not be a prototype any longer. It will it will be a, a finalized deal. But for now, it's still in prototype stage, and I'm not going to add blades to this particular glove. Instead, what I'm going to do is I've made a new set of templates for Brian, which I owe a glove, and I need to get good on that. So um, I took the templates and I made them a little bit more accurate than these. I changed a few things that I noticed was wrong that I didn't get quite right. And there's certain other things, you know, that I've done to his templates that are different. So it's just a, it's a, it's a very similar set of templates, but slightly different and I'm gonna use those templates and use this glove to build his glove off of and try to match those pieces up to this one as closely as possible hopefully get it as close to identical as possible we'll get a good comparison once I, once I actually start going through the build the build sequence which is coming soon and I'll be using all of my tools in this toolbox and everything here and showing you guys exactly what I'm going through to uh, to get the glove done. But once I be build Brian's glove up to this point, I will do a comparison to get an idea of, you know, how close I got it to the to the original build glove. 
and then I will put blades on his, weather the armature, and put the rings on and the whole shebang. And then once that's done, I will do a real mobility test with blades and all, rings, everything, and it'll be my real final mobility test on uh, this glove. But again, you know, the glove will change a little bit with each one I build until I get it to a certain point where I call it done. And I think that I can do it within the next three gloves that I build after this one. Brian's will be the first one. Next one I build is already spoken for as well. And the third one that I build, we'll see if anybody wants it or not. And if not, you know, it'll it'll be a part of my finalization process collection that I keep for myself because essentially this is all for for me for the most part what I'm doing here building this thing for me so I really appreciate you guys watching just wanted to do that update to clear you all in on exactly what's going on here and what what part of the phase we're at you know and everything and if any of you have any questions or any of you want to talk to me personally I'm an easy guy to talk to I'm always, you know, I'm always online, I'm always doing work on the computer, that's where I do my job, that's where I do my school, so, you know, I'm always around, so feel free to drop comments or ask me any questions you might have about what I'm doing, appreciate all you guys watching, and I'm going to put up uh, something pretty substantial, as soon as I get this order in, we're going to start building up a new glove off of this master model here, and it will be... It will be a full process for you guys. So, until next time, thanks for watching, and I'll see you then.